cipher. 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 A cipher. I think cipher. And flowing from one kill to another in a way where once he got that flow state going, it was probably the most high level quake maybe we've ever seen. The Quake 3 era of cipher. Cypher's been around the block. He's been there, done that, got the t-shirt. Guy's a, like a five-time QuakeCon champion, four or five time. He's won LAN events left, right, and everywhere. He's been doing it since he was 15. Cypher. Utter domination, but artistry to how he was doing it. It wasn't robotic. It was incredibly human. It was just the expression of someone who, in terms of games, playing the game, not thinking about the game, was just a genius in many ways. A prodigy, someone who naturally, almost feels like it's meant to play something like Quake 3. Got the advantage. Cypher's rockets though, one, two, and he's probably only gonna hit one more good one. Oh, and there comes wow, the kill. What and a shot. how does he do it? I'm a motherfucking cypher. Gonna make the jump on that cooler with the LG. It's gonna be a fight. Is someone gonna take the lead down tonight? Oh my god, cypher is the rail. Still a dream. I mean, Vengers, he's surviving, yes, but he's not. Oh my. He doesn't have the opportunity for now, but again, three, four minutes in. It's not over just yet. But Vengar is looking like he's gonna be a champion down. But. This should be more unreturned. Brags goes in for the rail and it misses. He's got dual wield, and with base being this weak, this is actually disaster territory. He didn't even need the Cypher rail. Cypher has been getting some great combos. And then we've got a little bit. Oh, the chat is coming out here for Cypher. The hang not going to be happy with that. Quake 4, right before Quake 3 came back. The skill in that summer, what summer was that? 2007. Yes. Like watching him as a player improve the way he did and taking Toxic to the limit multiple times and beating other players and then how he transitioned his game back into Quake 3 and the dominant force that he became. Oh, wow. Cypher is just amazing right now. It just dealing all sorts of free damage and knowing how to bait and be unpredictable compared to other players was something phenomenal that I you know, I think it'll be really hard to find in another player again. He's beat everybody. It's not like he's, you know, gotten to the finals and he's only been able to beat a certain player or whatever. No, he's like gotten to multiple finals and whoever is there, he's been able to come out on top. And Cypher picking up the map. The base is going to drop, he thinks that he's doing the double back. Have we ever seen a game quite like this? I've never seen someone being in that many tricky situations and get away. A young man from Belarus called Saif who obviously went on to be outrageously good. He's alive, but the question is for how long.